In this video, I will be teaching you about hydronium and hydroxide ions. A hydronium ion is a hydrogen ion with a positive charge, combined with a water molecule, represented by the chemical formula H3O+. Any compound that produces hydronium ions when it, when it is dissolved in water is referred to as an acid. Acids turn litmus paper red when they are exposed to them. The composition of a hydronium ion is an H plus acid with an H2O water molecule base to come together to form an H3O plus hydronium ion, which is a conjugate acid of water. A hydroxide ion is a simple polyatomic ion with a negative charge consisting of one oxygen ion and one hydrogen ion, represented by the chemical formula OH minus. Any compound that produces hydroxide ions when it is dissolved in water is referred to as a base. Bases turn litmus paper blue when they are exposed to them. Hydro the pH of hydronium, the pH of a solution, depends on its hydronium concentration. The equation to find the pH of a solution using its hydronium concentration is as follows. The pH is equal to the negative log of H3O plus, or the hydronium ion. In a sample of pure water, the hydronium concentration is 1 times 10 raised to the power of negative 7 moles per liter at room temperature. To find the pH of water, we solve the equation. pH is equal to the negative log of the hydronium ion, which in this case is 1 times 10 to the negative 7, and find that water has a pH of 7, which makes sense because water is neutral. The equation to find the hydronium concentration of a solution with a known pH is equal to is as follows. H3O plus is equal to 10 raised to the power of the negative pH. So for our previous example, H3O plus is equal to 10 raised to the power of negative 7, which makes sense because that ends up being 0 0.00000001 or 1 times 10 raised to negative 7. The pOH of a solution, such as hydroxide, is, um, depends on its hydroxide concentration. The equation to find the pOH of a solution using its hydroxide concentration you'll find is quite similar to that for pH, except for that this time it's pOH and you're finding the negative log of the OH minus. Similarly, the equation to find the hydroxide concentration of a solution with a known pOH is equal to the OH equal to 10 raised to the power of negative pOH. The pH scale is a scale that ranges from 0 to 14 and represents the acidity of a solution. Solutions that are less than 7 on the scale are acidic, solutions greater than 7 are basic, and equal to 7 are neutral. The concentrations of the ions, represented by H3O plus and HO minus, are each 1 times 10 to the negative 7, and the product of these concentrations equals 1 times 10 to the negative 14, also known as Kw the constant that represents the ion product of water. The equation for this can be seen below. Here are some sample problems regarding hydronium hydroxide ions. To determine the pH of a solution that has a hydronium concentration of 2.6 times 10 raised to the power of negative 4, we first have to remember that pH is equal to the negative log of the hydronium ion. Secondly, pH is equal to the negative log of whatever we had, the, our hydronium concentration, so we'll plug that in, 2.6 times 10 raised to the power of negative 4, and after a short calculation, we can determine that the pH is equal to 3.6. Next, we can determine the hydro hydroxide concentration of a solution that has a pOH of 5.7 by first realizing that the OH is equal to 10 raised to the negative power of pOH. Secondly, plugging in whatever our uh, value of pOH was, which was 5.7, so then we have 10 raised to the power of negative 5.7, and doing a short calculation to realize that OH minus is equal to 2 times 10 raised to the power of negative 6. Lastly, we can determine the pH of a solution that has a hydroxide concentration of 4.2 times 10 to the negative 9 by realizing that pOH is equal to the negative log of OH. Taking that negative log, so the negative log of 4.2 times 10 raised to the negative 9, and finding that to be a pOH of 8.38.
then we're not done we have to re recognize that poh and ph come together to create a sum of 14. if we realize this then we can determine that ph is equal to 14 minus oh which here is 8.38 and then simply calculate that ph is equal to 5.62 I hope this video was informative and uh, helped you to understand hydronium and hydroxide ions.